and welcome to another edition of Carbs here in Reckless Eating. The only show where I sit in a car and BS while consuming carbs. Matt Zion here from another mysterious vehicle. Lots of mysterious vehicles going around. As of filming this, I don't know when I'll be posted, but the Chevy Lumina, which is what I used to drive. Everybody always asked what it was, and I always joked that it was a Russian tank in the comments. Chevy Lumina has finally taken a dive. It is over. It was on life support as is. But uh, I am not going to be keeping that car anymore. It has had its last final performance. So rest in peace. If you see it on any other videos, that's because it's an old video. But I'm currently car shopping. We're going to find a different car. As you can see, I'm in a car that I borrowed at the moment. But we have two Starbucks reviews back to back for you. I'm still a little sick, so I apologize if there's like heavy breathing because I'm so clogged up. Or just in general, my voice might be a little off. Two things from Starbucks. And uh, the first one we're going to be doing here, let me pull it up, is the pumpkin cream cheese muffin. I was going to do the uh, Washington, what was it? The Washington apple pound cake, but they were out of them. Damn it. Damn it. I was kind of over the pumpkin stuff. I really am over the pumpkin stuff. I feel your pain in the comments when people are like, oh, no more pumpkin things. I get it. I get it. Trust me. I really do. I'm over it too, but I wanted to do some things that are brand new, and this is new, or at least returning to them. So this is what it looks like. It's, it smells like heavy pumpkin right now. You've got your cream cheese in the middle, pumpkin on the outside. All right, let's try it out. Brand spanking new from Starbucks. I'm trying to get a bite of everything. Mmm, not bad. The cream cheese part is just delicious. The pumpkin part so-so. Not the worst thing in the world, but it's also pumpkin, which is... Not my favorite thing that you would, you'd know that from uh, watching these videos. Get one more bite. Mmm, the cream cheese is awesome. Oh, yeah, the cream cheese part is just perfection. Also, go out and check out our gaming channel, Zion Mainframe Gaming, by clicking the annotation right there. If you like Let's Plays, combined with our personalities, that is a gaming channel for you. We're very questionable. I like this. I like this product. It's probably one of the better pumpkin things that I've tasted during the pumpkin craze. I give it a 4 out of 5. The cream cheese just really, really saves it. The pumpkin stuff is still good, but you have to be in the mood for something pumpkin, which I just never am. Combined, though, you got the super sweetness of the cream cheese and a, and a semi-sweetness of the pumpkin. Gives it a nice rounded flavor. For the price-wise, I believe it's uh, it was only a couple bucks. This was really worth it, in my opinion. Starbucks always has such nice little snacking items and whatnot. I'm still mad they didn't have my Washington apple pound cake though, son of a bitch. There you go guys, what are your thoughts on this product? If you've had it, let me know in the comments down below. If there's other little treats that you'd like to see me try from Starbucks, let me know in the comments down below. Tomorrow will be a uh, latte. So hey, there you go, coffee review coming. We'll see you then. Reckless eating. Reckless eating.